The wind is up, it is chilly, and the home hopes currently resting uh, early doors with Rasmus Hoygaard. Had low expectations coming into the week. He's been out with injuries to his ribs the last couple of weeks. Let's go down to the first and find Richie Ramsey with uh, his long range birdie putt. Short par for this first hole. He couldn't, could he? He could. Richie Ramsey, what a putter he is. What a great start. Second hole, Marcel Seam. Second shot. To the second. Oh, it was nearly in, wasn't it? Terrific shot, Seam. Rasmus, outside chance of a three here at the ninth. If he does, he'll be around 67. Slow down, slow down in the pit. Now, here's a question, Jamie. If the flag was in, would that, or out, would that have gone in? Not about speed, no. <laughs> this for a good start for Lara Tharbal. He steps his in, too. You'll hear a, a mixture of clapping and, and squeaking out there. We've got a plastic duck initiative. All of the uh, proceeds go to Kids Aid. Fisher, take the lead. Oof, makes it as well. Excellent goal from Ross Fisher. Just the one bogey, and that came on 16. That's a 97-yard par three. 131. Ball above your stance here. The tendency is to pull it, drag it to the right-hand side. Got to be careful being a lefty. Gonna try and feed this up the left edge of the green. Let the breeze do the rest. That's exactly what he did do. Good birdie chance coming up there for... McIntyre to get into the red. Fisher on the home hole. What a day he's had. And it could get a lot better as well. What a shot into 18, Ross Fisher. Down the hill for birdie at two, McIntyre. After an opening par, first dash of red goes on the scorecard. Ramsey up the hill. He likes the win, look at that. Doesn't do much, a little flick of the hands. Keeps it low. Lovely shot. Just don't overpower it when you're playing the wind at home. Just dial it down. Over the back of the par three, Ollison hit. Just closed the face down of a four iron and turned it over a little bit. Second shot back into the breeze a little bit. Well, no, maybe not. Maybe left side. That's well played. Looked like 11 1 then, didn't it? Speed. Um, this is Pablo up the hill. Again, it's really slow into the wind up the hill. Just hard to kind of commit to hitting those putts so hard. Back we go to Cabrera Bayo. Dare say you've played uh, alongside Rafa a number of times over the years. Any insights to his game, Oli? Uh, very rhythmical. You know, I think um, he's obviously not off to a great start, but he's a good wind player. You know, he's, he's got tremendous rhythm. Oh, yeah. oh, oh, French wasn't as good as that. Over the lot with his tee shot and then straight in. Pop that one on the highlights reel for us, would you? Over to 16 with Hemeland Hill. Back behind our camera angle. Cheering on Marcus Helikill to hit at that front left pin. I love holes like this. Different. That's going to go on. Go on. They're cheering it on. It's going to rank it. It's going to make it. There we go. Go on, down you go. Always stiffer, always. A little slider, but it is for birdie at nine. For Beergard to finish out his round in style, he does a 68. Start on a really good line. Did left me. What a shot from Bob McIntyre. <laughs> Here on five. Terrific. Not had an eagle on this hole all day. Birdie attempt at the fifth here for Nikolai. Well done. Two parts for it. In the end. Broholt Lint. Third shot. Oh, he's played that nicely. Look at this. How do you play this one? Do you try and fly all the way? If the wind catches it a little bit too much, you go over the back short side yourself. Me, I'm a kind of like 
want to hit it really Straight low, put it in the middle of the tier, hopefully get that little skip onto the back tier where that pin is today. Yeah, that's what you do, pitch it in the middle of the green and nearly hold it for two. Great shot from Rafa Cabrera Bayo. Third shot down on the green on eight. Very nice too, Torbjorn. The Rafa Bell. Good shot in, just trundled on a bit for the bird. Go on, he deserves it, he deserves it. Oh, and he gets it. Well, two over the bar. 37 out, it's been up and down. Birdie attempt here at the 17th. Very nicely done. Good caddy, Steve Rawlinson, caddying for him. He's been around a long time. Used to be a chef, Steve Rawlinson. Back to McIntyre, Johnny. Cool, this would be some birdie at this difficult ninth alley. I mean, the wind's going to affect this one. You've got to feel like it wants to come off the left, and that's due to the wind that's just pumping into his chest. All the way from McIntyre. That was in the second he hit it. Just tracking down that slope. What a super... First nine holes for McIntyre. Not easy. Now, this is Bryce Easton, South African, lives in Southport. Second shot here at the 17th. He's at five over. Something must happen. I that might go in. So, back to plus three. Huge drive in for a two. Little crafty shot from down there, isn't it? That's the way to do it. Adding to the difficulty of this shot for a lot of thought was on an upslope. This was a flatter lie. It would actually be pretty easy because you've got plenty of green to work with. Just bury the club underneath it. No follow through. Just like that. He is a magician around the greens. Best shot of the day, that, for me. Pablo de Rathabal. Brilliant shot. We're waiting on a wrap. Over the back of 11 with McIntyre. Feels like this. Flag's going to snap in a minute. It's absolutely blown like you wouldn't believe at the moment. Oh, that's a good try. Oh, yes, beautiful. Beautiful stuff. I told you he relishes the hard he ones. He did, yeah. Let's have a little chat about the lottery numbers, John. McIntyre, 12, birdie putt. Oh. Another one in. He moves within one, Robert McIntyre. He's firing right now. Yeah, so clubbing up one more, temperature's dropping. Ball's not going to carry as far. Wind straight back at you off the right-hand side. Oh, this is so low. Always a fall. How good was that? McIntyre. That was brilliant from McIntyre. It's a fiddly one, Jamie. No, similar kind of shot for McIntyre, just 20 feet further right from where Nikolai was. Looking at the same style of shot. See the ball a little bit further back in his stands, hands is further forward. Somewhere between the two is perfect, but both are pretty decent, nonetheless. Got it, sixth birdie of the day for McIntyre. Joins Fisher at the top. 123 yards for Bob McIntyre coming out of the first cut here. Now you've got to hit a strong fade up against that left to right breeze. Hold it up there. Get it stopped nice and quickly with this tight pin on the left. Jump. Whoa. Yeah, nicely done. Exactly that, John. He's playing some good golf, Boxy. He is very much so. Chance to take the outright lead, Johnny. Oh, what a golden opportunity. This is just a ball, ball and a half outside his right up the hill. Good chance, this. And he does. Four birdies in the last five holes for Robert McIntyre.
To watch another DP World Tour video, click here. And to subscribe, click here.